This morsel forno has endless uses. You can bake in it, you can barbecue, you can make bread in it, you make those wonderful cakes. I even cook baked Alaska in it, that wonderful dessert with ice cream in the middle. But it's magic when it comes to make pizza. It's actually a pizza oven. But you need a high temperature. You need a temperature of almost 300 degrees centigrade. And the way you get that is just to build up the heat, put lots of wood on. Feels really, really nice and warm here. I could stand here all day. But then, just again, using your scraper, move all the ashes to the back. And if you use the door of the Morso Forno, you can pop that in here. This really helps to bring the temperature up, which is great if you want to roast a chicken and sit out here on a Sunday and have a nice outdoor lunch. Just pop the door in like that, and then just leave it to sit until it warms up a little bit more. And while it's heating up, I'm just going to finish off a pizza. This is the pizza paddle, which is great for putting it into the oven and out again. Just made a yeast based dough, and you can top your pizza with whatever you want. I've just used a little bit of tomato. Then on top of that, I've put some of those lovely heritage tomatoes, a little bit of spring onion, some Murata or even mozzarella cheese, a little bit of salami, a few black olives. Finish it off with a little bit of spinach or coriander and a good sprinkling of olive oil and then into the oven to cook. Pizzas are great because they cook in minutes. As I say, everybody can make their own with their own flavor. Love it with, again, lots of herbs just over the top of it. A little bit of flat leaf parsley this time, just for colour. Scattered over the top, ready to serve.